my mind. This is one of several confrontations making rounds on social media. Take care of your own. We family. are, you. Then why are they dead? Outbursts against a blockade set up by those demanding a search of landfills for the bodies of missing or murdered Indigenous women. Your body this confrontation days later ended up on the man's doorstep. Police have charged a 19 year old with mischief for a rock thrown through a window. No charges have been laid for the red spray painted handprints. I'd rather the money be spent on living women who could be protected instead of women who are already dead. That's I'm why you're for that. Sinner, right? We deserve a peaceful burial, though, too. The Manitoba government announced last week it won't support that, spurring this unrest, saying a search would cost too many millions, take many months or years, and would put searchers at risk digging through thousands of tons of toxic, densely compacted waste here at the Prairie Green Landfill, where police believe Morgan Harris and Mercedes Myron's remains are. This has been dealt with in a very heartless way, uh, quite frankly, and uh, we do absolutely have to try as a federal government. An online petition with more than 35,000 signatures agrees. They need to go and get them. You know, I'm not going to have my nieces go sit at a landfill to visit their mom for the rest of eternity. It remains to be seen if Ottawa will commit to foot that bill. A judge hasn't yet ruled on the city's request for an injunction to remove the blockade. Melissa Ridgen, Global News, Winnipeg.